Hello, this is Travis, and we are just finishing up week seven. So only two more weeks to go here in Tallahassee for the legislative session. So hopefully they'll get the budget done and be able to get out of town on May 5th on time. Um, this week, the House uh, did pass out of its final committee the um, the bill that we've been referring to kind of as the 4D Surfside um, glitch bill, and that was House Bill 1395. So it passed out of that last committee. There are now about, with the amendments that they adopted, there are about half a dozen, about six differences in the two bills between the House and the Senate. So we're working now to kind of resolve those issues. I'll just give you an example of one of them. Um, the House has where instead of as 4D had, where it was 30 years for the milestone inspection, once your building hit 30 years of age, um, and then 25 if you were within three miles of the coast, um, the Senate had just made it 20, uh, I'm sorry, 30 years across the board. The House has it at 25 years across the board. So those are the kinds of differences that we're just trying to work out um, and, and um, get to be the same. Also, the House passed um, out of a final committee, House Bill 919, did do some additional tinkering to it. Again, it does not, as the original bill, does not impact just, um, condo associations, timeshares, co-ops, mobile homes, anything like that anymore. It only affects um, HOAs. Um, there still is the provision in there regarding the fining um, uh, provision. That would, that's the difference between that and the House Bill, I'm sorry, the Senate Bill, um, Senate Bill uh, 1114, which still has one more committee that it would need to go through. So we're still trying to, uh, we're working on that. Um, my guess would be if that bill was to ultimately pass the legislature, it would probably be in that Senate version, um, which would not have the fining um, provision. Um, also, they're still working on vacation rental, still does not impact associations. They're allowed, they're, their documents are not superseded or preempted in any way. Um, but again, that looks like it could be uh, uh, something that does not make, quite make it over the finish line either. They're still dealing with those but i mean airbnb folks don't like it uh local governments don't really like it so everybody is uh still working on that as well so a lot of things still happening here in these final couple weeks continue to please stay engaged it's been very very helpful the work that you've all been doing this session so thank you we're a team so we couldn't do it without you um so we appreciate your efforts as well have a great day talk to you later